So today I have the key fob to a 2022 Toyota 4Runner. This came out of a 4Runner TRD Pro, but it is the key fob that can be found in the whole 4Runner 5th generation lineup after the push to start refresh that happened around 2020. I'm going to show you just how easy it is to replace the battery in this key fob. So first off, grab your key fob. Um, up here where the key fob would connect to some keychain, locate this little slide button with an arrow on it. And what you're going to be doing is sliding it over, which will release a manual key right here. So kind of you can do both at the same time. So I'm going to slide it over with my thumb and pull up on this section, which will release this manual key. Now, Toyota is smart because they kind of use the manual key as um, a tool to get inside the key fob. So as you notice up at the top, it's kind of like a bezeled edge and it's going to go right in the middle right here and you're going to be able to twist the key fob into two pieces. Now in the middle of the key fob, there's going to be the circuit board, which is basically the buttons and on the back side is the battery. So kind of be careful and not drop the two pieces in the circuit board in the middle. So put your key manual key in the middle and twist up or down, whatever your preference is. You're basically going to be opening up the key fob. It's very simple. Just gently remove it. So you can put the side with the buttons over and this is the circuit board I was mentioning. You can put this to the side as well. So these are basically the buttons inside. Flip it on the back and that reveals the battery. So this is a Panasonic CR2032 battery. I'll put a link in the description uh, should you need to find one on Amazon and get you to the cheapest one. Now you can pop this out with your finger, uh, little manual tool. You can probably do it with this as well, but this is a brand new key fob, so I don't need to take it out, but pretend you are taking it out and just reinstall it. Just when um, you do reinstall it, the opposite side, the writing, try not to touch it with your uh, fingertips because the oils can diminish the life of the battery. So pretend you put it in, put the circuit board back in. Um, you're gonna kind of climb clamshell everything back together gently. I always warn, try not to push the red button while you're doing so because you're gonna probably irritate your neighbors. You're gonna hear some audible clicks and then don't forget to slide your manual key back in. But that's how easy it is to replace uh, the key fob battery in your 4Runner key fob. Thanks for watching.